And now we're joined via satellite in Paris by the CEO of EcoRay, Serhan Souzer, who will be discussing the potential future of solar power in Turkey with our Cape Cod host, Africa Malane. Hello, Jonathan. Uh, it's good to be on the show still, and this is a very important uh, broadcast. Hello. Saran, Greetings from uh, Paris. Let me start by... Agree. Thank you very much for joining us on this broadcast. You spent a decade in finance and tourism in your family's business and in 2011 decided, no thank you anymore, I want to be in sustainable solutions. What prompted the move? I wonder if you can hear me, sir, and I was asking what prompted you to leave your family business after spending a decade with them in 2011 uh, to move into uh, focusing on sustainability. Um, yeah, basically, uh, I have always been aware of, uh, you know, climate change. And I wanted to do, do my own thing. Uh, and after 10 years of working for my family company, I literally uh, uh, went and uh, knocked on my father's uh, door and said, uh, I want to do my own thing. And I asked for a loan from him. And uh, he asked me, what are you going to do with it? I, I told him, I'm going to invest in solar energy. That's, that's uh, in my heart. And uh, basically, uh, you know, after uh, three months of convincing, uh, I got the loan and I invested in uh, in solar technology, concentrating solar power, CSP, parabolic trough technology. Uh, and I worked uh, commercializing this technology over a year. And then I sold it to uh, an investor uh, because we achieved uh, you know, many criteria. And after that, uh, basically, uh, I established this, uh, this new business, Ecore, which uh, solely uh, concentrates on uh, photovoltaic. Uh, and uh, so uh, basically what we do, uh, we started with uh, project development and EPC engineering procurement and construction. Uh, and then o over the years, we expanded uh, the dimension of our business. Uh, now, now, we know you're investing in solar and wind and biomass, but your investment really is in solar energy and particularly high efficiency fuels. Why do you think that solar energy is the future for Turkey? Well, uh, I have to say uh, solar energy is uh, really important for Turkey. We have the, in terms of solar irradiation, we have the second uh, highest potential in Europe after Spain. And I keep saying that only solar power is enough to power the entire country. It's just that we need to make sure that we benefit from this potential. And, and we're one of the companies that uh, work on projects uh, to do more and more. And, and let's talk about entrepreneurs such as yourself and the investment you're making in, in, in the space. Uh, you obviously agree with the fact that it is entrepreneurship, it is innovation that will lead to a clean energy future in Turkey, correct? Uh, that's, that's right. Uh, basically, uh, when you talk about renewable energy, uh, it's basically uh, what we have in the nature and the technology. We have to constantly improve it. And uh, as a bold entrepreneur, the first uh, thing I did, uh, I put the money uh, all in the technology of solar power. That's how I started my career. And this year, uh, having built uh, some solar plants, and also started our wind business, uh, we basically, uh, uh, you know, decided to strategically invest in, in improving technology of solar power. So this year, uh, we uh, started uh, a new company, industry company, to manufacture high efficiency uh, panels, uh, integrating wafer, cell, and modules. Uh, and uh, basically what you have in the market right now is 19% uh, efficiency, panel efficiency maximum. And uh, we are betting on 22% uh, efficiency, uh, one-sided. And uh, by facial, we're going to go above 25%. So this is great news for the industry. And we're collaborating with 
uh, Swiss and German uh, company to bring this technology in Turkey and hopefully uh, in the future we're going to export from Turkey to all over the world. Uh, you know, we need to constantly work well, on, the, on the technology and uh, make sure that uh, we do better each year. <laughs> well, that's great to hear. Thank you very much indeed, Zaran, and I'm sure your family uh, will reflect on your success over the last couple of years and not be too sad that you left the family business in 2011. Uh, Jonathan, I haven't been to Turkey, but after hearing your review of your experience in Turkey, I certainly look forward to visiting. It's back to you.